Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to make a, um, a, uh, good mod room or something for your roll tech fan game. Pretty easy, so the first thing you want to do, you just want to, um, you want to, uh, get Pro Builder, which is in, um, I don't have my package manager here. You want to go to Unity Registry, search up Pro, and get Pro Builder, uh, for you, we'll say install. For me, it says remove since I have it. And then you want to go to tools, pro. Oh, my bad, my bad. Um, you want to go to uh, tools, pro builder, and pro builder window. And then it should like pop up like right here or something. Move it down, and you should have a new set of thingamajigs here. So the first thing you're going to want to do, click plus, create a pro builder cube. And um, you want to make this about the size that you want your room to be. And then I'll mention how like you can get mod vents going there and stuff. So let's just make our room uh and and it I know it looks like we're um so if the mod room is out of the map then um then uh then I'll tell you what to do. But if the mod room is in the map, um then I will tell you what to do as well. So, we have our room here, and as you can see, we can't go in. It's just a big block. Uh, I click 2. Yeah, alright. Uh, don't click 2D. Uh, and you want to go to Pro Builder, and you want to do, um, Flip Normals. And now your room looks like this. And, um, if you enter, this is kind of like a plane, you just enter, and you're in the room. Um, I'm going to mention how to get an entrance and exit in here. But, um, if your room is, like, uh, in the map, like, for example, you just have, like, one like some so, small mod vent going into the mod room. And what you need to do, just duplicate this and click flip normals as well. But do not do that until um, you have made your exit or your, yeah. So um, now to make an, an entrance, uh, you wanna select, you wanna go on this little thing and select the face that, you, that your door is gonna be. So I'm going to expand my little island over here and, and I'm going to add, and this is where our first let me get a vent. Uh, if you haven't already watched my tutorial on how to make vents, it's pretty easy. Um, we're gonna delete these faces. Oh, sorry, this is taking so long, but delete faces. Bam. So, in, in my case, the mod room will be out of the map. So, let's get our little area here and for now we'll just stick it in the map so we can see where our boundaries are and just select my edges and since there's not a face there and we can expand it there um so now we have our entrance here so we want to select the face that we're going to do this on and we want to click detach faces here and now what we're going to do we're going to use the edges tool we're going to move it up right about how this is, and we're going to duplicate this. And then we're going to go, and we're going to, um, and we're going to click on this, uh, new one, the duplicate, and we're going to drag it over to here, like our next wall. And you want to grab the top edge on the duplicate, which is this one, and you just want to drag it down. Now, your thing will do this, and... Um, that's because we're just, uh, flipping the normals again. All you gotta do is fix that, just flip normals. And, uh, yeah, it looks normal now. And now, um, what you can do, you can just, uh, duplicate this again. Uh, use the edges tool. And we can, um, do this. Select this. Um, let me just select the duplicate. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Um, I wanna do it from this side. I can't do it there so now we have it there and we just want to bring it here and bam it looks completely normal it doesn't look like we like cut anything and it looks pretty nice and uh we're gonna go ahead and flip the normals on both of these or we're gonna duplicate them both and then flip the normals so uh by the way you need to flip normals on this wall uh whenever you uh you need to select all of these by the way and duplicate flip normals if you are if you have a mod room outside of the map. And then you can add a vent from my vent tutorial. Pretty easy. This is how you make a mod room. It actually looks pretty good. So I hope you guys have an amazing day. And goodbye.